Welcome back, everyone. Criminal Archer here. Time for some more Children of Morta. Wandering around here. What is this tab? It says tab says something. Little Ben's workshop has been upgraded. All right. Yes, we were gonna look at this more. So this is 325, 100. Let's get one of these. We yeah, got 395. Let's get the speed as well. Why not? One of everything. All right. Is there anything we need to check out? Nothing could quite match the calm that Linda felt when playing her violin. Its sublime sound, the perfect counter to the nerve-wracking uncertainty and chaos. That's a nice little moment. Library we've already seen. Wild mushrooms must be ripe for the picking by now. She knew where it was coming from. Her ancestors had spoken of such corruption flooding down the mountain. But Grandma Margaret wanted to know what it was, and what needed to be done to destroy it. Margaret knew full well that signs and symbols were seldom obvious and never direct. She was certain that the cause of the corruption would be difficult to discover. Why would the mountain god corrupt the world? What kind of evil was it that brought it forth? For Margaret, these questions were as important as where and how. Okay. This is still just the same, right? I just want, just wanted to make sure. All right, so I think I'm going to try and do um, Daddy this time instead of Archer Lady. Let's try and do the skill, the Silk Caverns. We'll do John this time. Give him a try. See how different it plays. Maybe we can get further. That'd be nice. <laughs> I'm really curious to see the bosses, so I'm hoping we make it there. Trying to remember it. Remember our buttons. Alright, it seems like our, our attack has a bit of a knockback, which is good. Just hack at it. Hack, hack, hack. Not in the Mars attacks way. Ack, 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 ack. Ooh. A bat actually got us. That never happened with the other lady. Not, this is not my play style. So hopefully this hopefully this we don't die too fast here. I'm much more the archer type. It's the name. So that's not where the name comes from at all. Hello little blobbies. I got a skill point. Shield of Thorns is a passive ability. Melee attackers take damage when blocked. Where I can, yeah. Look at that. Well, come to me, I'll just blast you. All right, let's go check out that, um... I just got a, a, a key, essentially. A little crystal dealers. So let's open this guy up. Life drain? Hell yeah. Like me some life drain. So I have, I have 96, I'm trying to see how much life drain this is actually draining. 
One held a gift. Two hid ferocious creatures. It was the lady or the tiger, hmm. the Bergson. Let's go right up the middle. Oh. So that was just pain? That doesn't seem like ferocious creature, that just seems like pain. Alright, well, whatever. I don't know why I hit that button. Just seemed like thing. All right, we're at seventy-nine. Still at seventy-nine. Maybe it only fires sometimes. It's not like an every time fire. Why don't you look at what your active abilities are? That was definitely something about lifesteal, wasn't it? Still 70. So I guess if it's lifesteal, it's not very much lifesteal. Oh, 81. So we did get something there. I guess maybe it's like streaky? I don't know. We'll figure it out eventually. Or we won't. We'll die before we figure it out. Who knows? We go either way. Well, that wasn't a very good use of that. It's funny how different enemies are, are more trouble depending on the character you're playing. Like for instance, these little bat guys are, were no problem with the archer character. I don't think I ever got hit by one of them. But they're, uh, they're messing me up with this guy. Oh, that was not the right key. I meant to dodge before and I hit the I mean I hit meant to hit the the swords from heaven attack and I hit the hit the dodge attack instead. Oh that hurts me. Okay. Didn't know that hurt me. Alright. So, you know, it's good to play dad every once in a while, but I'm gonna go back to the other guy, I think. Other lady. She's much more my playstyle. Kevin's need to help all began when his older brother Mark left the house. He was strong, making any near him feel safe. But he left Kevin. Though Uncle Ben knew what his nephew needed. A focal point for his aspirations. But Ben still had his leg, I think. Hmm. What are the character moments right now? Doesn't look like it. Oh, something's going on here. Uncle Ben pondered over a map he received from a refugee. The silk caverns were a twisted maze of dead ends and venomous nests. 
But somewhere along the right path, Anea Daya, spirit of the Caldipo Caves, rested. Okay. I don't think I made enough. Oh, I did make enough money. Let's get more damage. More damage! Try again. Take this lady this time. The silk covered walls of stone. Foul smelling excretion being pressed into the soft dirt beneath their feet. The creatures were more active than you. Alright. Maybe with our increased damage and whatnot we'll be able to handle well, we seem to be one-shotting some of these creatures so that seems good that might just be the critical strikes though we'll see right, I'm trying to get through this level quickish so we can get to the new bits we find the opening the ending I'll probably just go there instead of spending a lot of time looking for the rest of the stuff We're definitely hitting harder so that's good A lucky dodge there. Hey. And then a not lucky dodge. I don't have any I don't have any ability to open chests yet, so don't have to worry about that. Nothing over here. Another one. Just check. Oh. Oh. Just took my hand off the keyboard there for a second to scratch my nose. <laughs> yeah, I showed up. Tricky to time those like when there's where they're supposed to hit. Gotta learn the timing better. Because I can't give myself that much trouble. We've been playing for we put what I don't know 40 minutes of game time into this so far. Can't expect to be a pro at it this fast. Where you going, Mr. Bat? Here's the item room. Bramble wrappings added to items codex. I think I was looking at the wrong thing there. Afflict damage to enemies on contact. Okay, so if we touch them, we hurt them. Um, I'm just going to leave. I want to go and just get to the next level. There's probably more stuff to find. We could probably get some of those chests open, but oh well. Oh, oh. The halls of Anea Dyer, so mesmerizing in their magnificence, were to be found at the end of a long road. And a hero never knows what is awaiting them at the end of a road. Moving is more important than reaching. Guess that's where we're going.
a little bit of damage there. When they go into that, like, see-through mode right there, or, so the walls become see-through, it looks way worse than it actually turns out to be. Whoa, hello. Something about the purple look of it makes it look way worse. Oh. Got caught on the wall and I didn't catch it. Oh, there's a gemstone up here. Oh, I missed that before. Can't miss that sweet, sweet gold. I thought that guy attacked me, but he just splattered. <laughs> uh, hopefully this is okay. Good. Just item room. Create a totem that damages enemies from a distance. So it's, it's just a, like an attack totem. That's nice. It's like a 40 second, maybe a 45 second cooldown on it. Only lasts for about 15 seconds, it looks like. Ooh. I didn't even see those spikes. Lucky I didn't get hit by them. what this room is, but I'm kind of nervous about it. Last time we went into it, I mean, in the last episode we went into an unusual room and ended up in that weird um, challenge room, which didn't go well for us as we may, as everyone may remember. that plus to enemies slain? If that's some sort of like streak bonus? Maybe you kill enough enemies in a row? I don't really know what that was exactly. Yeah, it's some sort of streak, because it just went up to 12 while I was in the middle of that. What is that? 69, dudes! <laughs> Probably Pisces. Grim's Orbit. Flames Orbit, you're damaging it. Oh, okay. So we got a little bit of protection if... Things get too close now. Hey. Thank 
you for the healing. Like the sound, don't like. Look at this, he's got weird crystal things. Okay, right, got it. Thank you for all the gold. I feel like our, I mean, our. I like that we have this extra defense, but I feel like this is much more the kind of thing that you would need for the the melee character. Woo. Man, that that graphic is so big on the screen. I also did see that this corpse over here um, has an F. I wonder if when I dodge through enemies if my little swirly sphered guys um, count their, if their damage counts because that'd be kind of neat if they do would be an interesting little strategy or if they go invulnerable like we do intangible maybe I don't know mm, I don't like the look of that <laughs> I'll come back to you in a second. I want to go check out that one room we skipped. Since that door we just opened looks an awful lot like the door to the challenge room that got us killed last time. <clears throat> Along came Grandma to decipher another tablet. There are those to join forces with the Bergsons yet, was what Margaret told of the tablet's message. Shrine of Remembrance unlocked. Break all the pots. Can I talk to Grandma? No. Alright, I guess we're going that way. Gold I almost left behind. Would have been tragic. Alright, I haven't been down this direction yet. Damage resistance received. It's a timed thing. I'm tempted to go back to the the challenge room thing before this thing runs out, which I think I'm going to do because it seems to be the only direction to go. Oh, wrong way. It's going to run out anyways, though, to be honest. We'll get a little bit of it. Not enough for it to matter, but... Not all in the caves were refugees. Some were just traveling merchants stuck in a bind. I'm trying to hold off using the totem as long as we can get away with. In case um, people are wondering why I have not fired that up yet.
I do it now. I don't know how many. Oh, okay, just the two. So we almost completed it before. His hat. He invited them to stop by his shop later, promising something for all adventuring needs. Shopkeeper rescued. What is this? Increases the amount of money gained. Don't mind if I do. Okay, so we just go out of here? But where do we go? I've been everywhere. If it's not through here, where am I supposed to go? Oh, these are actually functional now. Stamina regions faster. Yeah, see, this is just a, a wall. It's just a wall up there. Go anywhere this direction. Here we go. It's the next level. I assume this is the boss. We'll go check out the boss. Potion, probably health potion. Yeah, this has got to be the boss. All eight eyes. Of course, big spider. Why not? No, I never did. Just checked on my scope. All right, see that seems to actually be holding. All right, so I got three points to spend here. Harmonize. Plus 160 damage. Let's go do that. Oh, I'm getting, keep getting... getting um, held up here yeah this this is not gonna go well our mobility is just shot here yeah we're, we're totally toast <laughs> I can't this this boss is real bad for my mobility oh well well we got to see the boss this time we got the shopkeeper unlocked. Next time I play, for the next episode, I may start at the boss. Rather than show you the whole play up to that point, considering we... I think there's probably a little bit more past this boss, don't you think? A little bit. Yeah, those webs, man, they mess up your mobility. Something fierce. A set of daggers made just for him. They would be his guide to finding himself. His focal point. The boy tested them. They felt good. Not too heavy, not too light. Like an extension of himself. Uncle Ben suggested a few practice swings outside. The daggers sliced the air, guided with an easy grace. His nephew was clearly a natural with the blades, and would be ready to join his father and sister in no time. But the boy's mother had words <laughs> on that subject. Two of her children were fan. already risking their lives, 
and she would not have her precious little boy out there as well. Regretfully, he took the daggers away. Who was he to argue with a mother when it involved her child? Handing over the daggers was like abandoning a part of himself. Mom's no he fun. He wasn't meant for them. Meant to be out there fighting for what was right. He just needed to convince them. All right. Shopkeeper? Whenever Margaret deciphers a tablet, Rhea reveals something new to the Bergsons. Bergsons. Given enough resources, she will then be able to strengthen the family. The mysteries of the world were like open books to the wise, and knowledge from the wise shall benefit man and beast. Alright, so this is the other. Increases more items drops, the typo there. Increases shrine effects. Unlocks various slots. Yeah, alright, so this is all things. Locked right now, but, you know, in the future. Oh, no, we can do this here. Well, we could. But we don't have the money for it. Cool. Alright, well, I'm going to stop here, and I'll see you guys later. Thanks so much.